Our top story two weeks after News 12 broke the story of a homeless tent city forming under I-95 in Bridgeport, the state now plans to shut down the community. Frank Recchia with the story. Every day, thousands of people cross the I-95 bridge in Bridgeport without ever realizing there is a whole community of people living under the bridge in what has come to be known as Bridgeport's only tent city. How do you feel about this place shutting down? I'm hurt. I'm hurt. This man, who asked not to be identified, says for the past six months, this little village has been the only stable home he's known for years. But DOT officials telling News 12 Connecticut today it is illegal for people to live on this state property. And come Friday, they'll be fencing it off and officially shutting the place down. You don't want to be in a shelter? No. I just want to hope. I got a heart for this. It's my passion. But Damian Holly of the nonprofit Operation Hope. I'm one paycheck from all this. Is one of many outreach specialists. Tent City. Who've been working around the clock this week to try and relocate all of the Tent City residents. The Bridgeport YMCA South End Community Center has offered to take all of them in. We got people out on the ground. So you can't say that we're not out here because we're out here. I urge anybody that's staying at Tent City, please come to us at 650 Park Avenue while you will be safely housed. If they want to come in and they want these services, we are here to help. We have mixed feelings. Some people want to stay, some people don't want to. So, but it's all about re-engaging. What's it, a big achievement? Oh yeah, I put them in a the shelter. This man says he defiantly doesn't want to be sheltered because he'd have to get rid of virtually everything he owns. I'm only allowed to take one back. Hell no. I will find another location. You will not stop me. This is stuff that y'all don't see. In Bridgeport, Frank Recchia, News 12, Connecticut. Uh, city officials urging all tent city residents to seek shelter and long-term housing services.